Okay, welcome back. It's the Bedmeister streaming Abzan Counters Company. Um, so we're two and two in this league at the moment. We've beaten Hardened Scales and we've beaten As Nauseam. We've been absolutely smashed by um, Storm and Amulet Titan. If you do want to watch someone actually um, five O leagues with this, check out Lapless Jan, who sometimes plays on Cardnock Life because. He is a hell of a lot better with this deck than I am. Um, but we're going to see whether we can make it 3-2. It is the first competitive league I've played in, so maybe I shouldn't be too hard on myself. Um, we'll see. So, I don't think this is a bad hand. I'm going to keep it. Lead off with birds. Hopefully get a knight down early and start pressuring life total. Um, okay, Burn is a tough matchup. Burn is a tough, tough matchup. We're going to play out Bird. Let's see whether they bolt it. Turn one. Let's wish the opponent good luck. Wonder whether this is going to be um, standard burn or looking at this land, I wouldn't be surprised if it was an arc like arc like phoenix kind of burn deck. Playing monstrous swift spear and that new creature from Guilds of Ravnica that I think comes back from the graveyard if you cast three instants or sorceries in a turn. Green Marvel Mancer, wowzers. So I'm going to play the birds out anyway because if it dies, it dies and it will be two less cards in my opponent's graveyard for them to use Grim Lava Mance or something else. Can't see the bird lasting longer than this turn now that the opponent has fetched. I think Grim Lava Mance is really good at the moment. I think it's a well positioned creature. Eidolon of the Great Ravel. So, I mean, this match could be pretty much over before we started here. I'm going to search a basic planes. And I'm going to play out the Knight, because it's a 4-4, four, four. take 2 off Eidolon. Can I race burn from here? I don't even know if I can. I suppose I could sacrifice this, I'd turn it into a 5-5, five, five. Field of Ruin. 6-6. Six, six. I think I block. I think I just try and survive and get massively lucky with Collected Company. They're going to take two off the bolt. The monastery still dies. Rift Bolt. So I'm not playing a Rising Canopy because obviously I would be taking a damage off it. Take another two of Lava Mansa. Got one card in hand. I'm down to seven. Just gotta hope they swing in with everything. They take two. They're on thirteen. I'm on seven. They draw.
I, I would imagine them swinging in with both. They're not going to swing in with both. I'm very surprised. Okay. In which case, they've dodged a bullet. Okay, I am going to. I'm going to play a Horizon Canopy. I'm now going to. Get rid of their white source. Burn, I don't think, runs basic planes. They're going to play skull crack. So, in response to that, I'm going to eat a knight. I'm going to eat a bird, which is. Makes no difference, but at least it grows the scavenging ooze. Get another clue. At this point, I'm not going to attack and. So they do two to me, I'm on three. If they've got a bolt, they've won anyway. In my upkeep, I'm gonna get rid of my birds. On a massive one life. Lava spike. And then they can kill me with Grim Lava Mancer. Good game. Close, but no cigar. Good game. Opponent begin sideboarding. So I'm bringing in another scavenging ooze. I'm bringing in a core firewalker. I'm bringing in Shalai instead of walking ballista. I'm bringing in a selfless spirit. Corsa stays. Tracker, I'm not as worried about. Knight of Autumn definitely stays. Might take out a Dusk Watch here. Okay, and we're back off to the races against Burn. My suspicions weren't. Oh, wow, that's a decent hand. So I've got Corsa around, scavenging use for life gain. Um, my core, my suspicions weren't confirmed last game in terms of the fact that the opponent did not play Arclight Phoenix. So, turn one play, Forest and Noble Hierarch. Lava Spike. Turn to play. Well, I was thinking about playing Corsa, but as I've hit the knight, I reckon I can start putting on a, a big amount of pressure here early on. I'm hoping my noble hierarch hangs around, but it doesn't. Uh, 
Ah, great. So what do we do here? We attack. <clears throat> So, do we want to deal ourselves two damage here, is the question. If we do deal ourselves two damage, we can play Knight. There's another 4-4, four, four. swing back for 8, they're dead in two turns. I suppose if I'm not going to play Knight and I was going to play Noble Hierarch, I should have played it before I attacked. Hence the importance of thinking through your turn before you play any cards or before you do anything, as opposed to waiting until after combat. Um, I don't think I'm going to take two. I think I'm going to play the ooze, which means I can start gaining life. They might choose to prioritize the ooze over me. I'm trying to talk myself around to this way of thinking. Um, and I can get rid of Noble for a life if I need it. They play Lightning Helix, so. So wow, again, what do I do here? Okay, so I think at this point I play the Corsa, gain a life. I'm playing Noble Hierarch, so I can start attacking with that. I've got a Knight in my back pocket. I've got Eternal Witness, maybe to get back Scoos. Okay. They've seen enough, thank goodness. Can I make this League 3-2? Come on. Come on. Anything I want to bring in here. Eidolon of Rhetoric. I mean, it's not particularly good against Burn, other than the fact it means it can't cast more than one spell, but I worry. Am I just doing that just to make the maths easier? I think, to be honest, cards like Scavenging Ooze, Knight of Autumn, I think they're stronger. I'm going to mulligan that because I can't play anything. Oh dear, dear me. Mm. So I've got to take two damage. This is tough. Is it tough? What would you do? Would you keep this or would you mulligan it? Turn one birds. Trouble is, I could really do with a land, but I don't think that's the land I want. <laughs> Birds. I suppose there is a chance here that if 
the opponent doesn't interact with any of my creatures. Okay, forget that. Just gonna have to take this damage, man. I'm perilously close to losing already, and I think what I would like next turn is a basic land on top of my deck. I can play, not taking any damage, so that I can cast Collected Company out of nowhere. That isn't gonna happen. Dear, dear me. So they attack, they play a burn spell. That's seven. <sighs> I've completed the league. The lesson is, I need to get better with this deck, and I need to get better at Magic the Gathering. But thank you very much for watching. This is the Bedmeister signing out.